When we talk about 25 years of Femina Hip, we're talking about Femina Hip, the organization. But this organization supports FEMA clubs across the country. The FEMA club system itself is 20 years plus. We have two programs that support FEMA clubs. One is the media program. Two is the community outreach program. The media program makes sure that in collaboration with the young people themselves, we create information out of that. We create package with knowledge. These packages go to the young people so that they can active learn from them. Active learning is where you, you don't just learn. You learn and you can teach someone else. You learn and you can do something about what you have learned. We have created something that gives young people the power to grow, the power to create change in their communities, the power to understand who they are and their purpose here, the power and, and motivation to fulfill the potential that they have. So the media products that we produce, uh, and over the years we have had the, the, the FEMA TV show, the Rukaju Entrepreneurship Competition on TV, the FEMA magazine, which is like the biggest one and the oldest, the FEMA radio show, and increasingly online with the social media and, and the websites. So all of these meant to, in a way of media and communication, to bring information, and knowledge, and, and motivation to young people and to start to create change for themselves and for their community. We have over 2,400 clubs currently as we speak now that we are supporting across the country. And these clubs are supported by, I can say, volunteering teachers. So we call them mentors because what they do is beyond teaching. As long as we have people being born in Tanzania, it means every day someone enters puberty. It means we need to be there every day to be able to guide their way.